AUC is one of the known universities for having the best and biggest campuses. Students of AUC are among the most outgoing and communicative group of students in Egypt. Campus is one of the main reasons that helps students achieve the best of their social life. It also provides students with work and entertainment spaces, and it also gives a chance for those who are into sports their athletic space. Students are able to easily communicate with their peers as they share many common interests. Also, professors at AUC are trained to find the best way to communicate with their students in order to give them the best quality of education. However, when the pandemic struck Egypt, everything changed. Communication became a lot harder, and it was a challenge for both students and professors. Since the campus closed, the spaces where students were most likely to communicate weren't there anymore. This has weakened the communication between the AC community as a whole. None of them thought that one day they would have to deal with each other only through technology. In spring 2020, AEC introduced a remote way of learning. Ever since, learning has shifted to become totally online. AEC has been communicating through online communication platforms like Zoom, Panopto for recorded lectures, and Blackboard. This type of communication and learning has its advantages and disadvantages. As tricky and new to the world, online communication is, it has its fair share of advantages. The first advantage the online communication provides is to allow students and professors to communicate without being restricted to a specific time or place to meet. It also allows students to do their group projects, attend classes, and take exams remotely without having to expose themselves to the virus. They can also turn learning information into real knowledge and people can share and add to other information by using tools like discussion forums on Blackboard or on Panopto. Online communication also comes with a set of disadvantages. One of the first disadvantages is that professors aren't always available and it isn't easy to communicate with them. The communication with the professors requires more time than it would take if it was face-to-face, -face, since the professors don't access their emails frequently. Another disadvantage that students face, and it also bothers professors, that communication isn't as organized as they would like it to be. Students can speak at the same time with other colleagues since they can't see them, and therefore it can turn to be a chaotic and unorganized discussion. Also, since professors can't see their students face to face, they won't be able to give them proper feedback or know if they were confused about something. This causes students to abandon their studies more easily. So usually you have feedback when you see people, you look into their eyes, you understand if they get you or they don't. Uh, they look lost, so you ask them. So that's obviously one of the things we lack when we try to engage online or teach online or explain something online. Another thing that causes students to stress and give up on learning is that a lot of professors keep on nudging students and spamming them with emails. They believe that it's an effective way for improving students' learning, but for most students, it is stressful and overwhelming. Also, communication isn't easy online because some students easily lose focus when they're sitting at home and not in class. This makes them communicate less than they would if they were sitting in class. Some people can't keep track of what's being, saying, what's being said online uh, because they just lose concentration, they lose focus. Um, monotonous uh, sound makes things difficult uh, to concentrate. Lastly, the biggest disadvantage of them all is losing internet connection. Internet connection is the main thing that online communication depends on. And if that fails, the whole process of communication fails. The infrastructure in Egypt is already bad, so it's a risky thing to depend on it only.